Owls have better hearing than almost any animal in the world, but what we'll demonstrate next is that they can also fly almost silently. We'll do that with the help of our two volunteers. So let's see, Joe, looks like we got them both. Who do we have? We've got Freddie and Teresa. Give them a big round of applause. Go right on. So come on over here. I need you to both take a seat on this box for me, facing the audience. Make sure your cameras are on. This happens pretty quick, okay? Now, in just a moment, we'll invite the owl to the window right over here to our left. Joe. I will not. Great. From that window there, the owl will fly out to the back and we'll let it stump way back there where you see Ashley. See her waving at you? Perfect. From there, I'll call the owl back to stage. That's where you want to get your photo in the owl's flight path. So when you see them somewhere around, right around here probably, okay? In that spot, take your pictures. Then both of you want to get your cameras out of the way right before that impact. Laughing. Yeah, I like that. No, come on. No kidding. Of course. The last second, he's going to swoop up over your cameras, land on the stump right here behind you. Okay, now it's closed, but don't worry. He is almost never missed. <laughs> come on, look to your left. We'll meet him. His name is JJ. He's called a great horned owl. It's actually the most abundant owl to be found in all of North America. Oh, man. We're going to turn around and make his way up here in just a moment. Listen up as he flies. You ready? Oh, you ready? Very nicely done. Now, if you want, I'll be going to have you stand up and turn around to get a picture. This is going to stump as well. Yeah, come right over here. It won't stay there too long. You'll get a picture real quick. You can get one on the stump as well. There we go. Beautiful shot right there. Another round of applause for our two very great volunteers. They were 